Tuesday, everybody. I hope everybody had a fabulous Easter. I am going to open my prize package that I won from Mia. Hi, Mia. Thank you so much. Um, I hope everybody had a fabulous Easter. I started to chat with you all about Easter this morning because I did a box packing of Mama's Little Monkey. And then I thought, oh, I probably will make another video before she makes it home. Little Lucy Ray says hi to her mommy. She says, hi, mommy. Mm -hmm. I started to have her kiss with this hand, but she's being mini pearl over there with that. That's what I was talking about in one of my box packing. See the U.S. clothes? They put the tag right there. So, anyway. Let me take the little packages out. Thank you so very much, Mia, for your lovely giveaway. We'll start with the card. Um, anyway, we woke up. Y'all know I was talking about how fun it is to, like, April Fool's people. Well, God played an April Fool on me. We woke up to snow. <laughs> Look at this beautiful thank you card. Thank you, Mia. Look at the beautiful sunflower on it. Let me read this. Oh, thank you so much, Mia. You're so sweet. I have loved Mia's channel from when I first found it years ago. Ah, uh, Mia's just a sweetheart. Everything. The two packages are wrapped in pink tissue with a lovely sage green. I don't know if I've ever seen sage green ribbon, um, like the curling ribbon before. That's really beautiful. Um, I like that color. Anyway, we woke to snow as I think many people did. Oh, look at this. I actually was going to order some of these, Mia, off eBay. So thank you so much. I love these tiny little bottles. Um, one of the Reborn sites sells them. Who was it? But they don't let you pick the color. <laughs> but thank you. It's a tiny little uh, two-ounce preemie bottle. So thank you so much for that. And here's one of the beautiful Passy Clips that Mia makes. It has lovely wooden beads in um, wood, you know, wood color, and there's green and red and yellow, and then there's uh, block beads that spell out the word baby. The B is in pink, the A is in yellow, the next B is blue, and the Y is in purple. Oh, this is so beautiful. And on the clip, can y'all see there's a little gingham bunny in green and white gingham with the happiest smile and the rosiest cheeks. Oh, so sweet. Thank you so much. Now, most of my babies don't use passies, but I like to use these and put a little toy on the end. So I use it as a little toy clip. We'll lay that. Thank you, Lucy Ray, for being my helper today. Look, Mommy, she's a helper already. And then, let's see what's in here. I think this one's going to make Vijan Ye super happy. Y'all know she's my book girl. Ugh, I don't like to rip paper. Um, anyway, so my husband and I on Saturday had talked about going to the park on Easter and taking a nice walk while we woke up to snow and like bitter cold temperatures. And this week it has remained cold. Oh, there's a bonus. Oh, there's a Passy, a Winnie the Pooh, or as I call him, Penny the Woo. I might have to put that on your clip, Mia. And put that with one of the babies as a little prop. That's cute. Oh, so cute. Oh, and here's the book, Little Bunny. And it, the book is shaped like a lop-eared bunny with him on the cover. Oh, look, it shows them in their burrow. Oh, bless. That's where my bun bun goes in the cold, is down in the burrow. Look at these pictures, they're so beautiful. She has one, two, three, four, five bunnies. Look at the beautiful flying bird. Oh, this is so sweet. Bijan Ye is going to love this. Oh, look, they're all cozy sleep. Well, not all of them. That one's still awake. But the other four are all snuggly sleeping. But their mommy, so cozy. Let me go give this to Bijan Ye. She's going to be so excited. She's the book girl. We're going to trade out from your kitty cat book for the bunny book. She says, thank you, Mia. Um, anyway, so we have just been having rain now this week um, and very gray. But thank you so very much, Mia, for your beautiful giveaway. And again, I'm so happy that you're back making videos. You were missed when you weren't making videos. 
and I am so happy that you're back. Right? Everybody say yes. Thank you so much, Mia. This was actually a surprise. I went to the, I, I'd forgotten or hadn't thought about it. And uh, I went to the post office today to send um, little monkey home, mama's little monkey. And I thought, well, let me just check. Cause sometimes, you know, they put those weekly sale flyers. So I don't like them to build up for the postal workers. And I opened it and there was a key. I'm like, hmm, I don't think I ordered anything that I haven't received. Duh, it was a blonde moment. But I'm allowed them because I'm blonde. So, all right, next, I am going to show you a baby that just was born this afternoon at 3.50 this afternoon. I'm so excited to introduce you to this little boy. He's actually just in a diaper right now, and I'm going to dress him with y'all. So let me just turn the camera so you can see. There's my boy, Saskia. I'm going to take you off so you can see. There he is in all his glory. He is on a custom um, ethnic skin tone body. Oh, he's so beautiful. He's got a head full of curly hair. Oops, that little straggler back there. He does not have a mommy yet, so if anybody's interested, I don't know when I'll be getting to his photo shoot. Probably the end of the week or next week because I have not painted yet at all this week. And so I really need to paint tomorrow. Um, I just feel like I haven't painted. When is the last time? Did I paint on Friday or Thursday? I don't recall, but I haven't had the opportunity. It's just been kind of a busy week and um, I really, really want to paint tomorrow. So um, I probably will not be doing his photo shoot yet, but I'm going to actually try. Um, I'm going to put him in something warmer because it's cold. But before I do that, I want to try this little outfit on him. We have a, um, a resale shop in our town that has an antique section. And I, when I walked in the other day, I saw this outfit and it looked really large. And I thought, shame that's not smaller. And then I turned and on the other table, they had the same outfit, smaller, and in its original box. I mean, the box is a little, you know, banged up. The original price was two ninety eight. I paid more than that. That's all I'll say. But I don't know if it's going to fit him. It's listed, I think, at nine months. I brought it home, and I put um, dryer sheets in between everything and in the box to, yeah, to help get rid of, you know, how older things smell. Oh, it's kind of see-through. But we're just going to try it on him. It is um, like a, a diaper cover, but it has a little fly on the front. It's faux. I mean, there's no zipper or anything. It's a lovely um, pale yellow. And then the waistband is white, and there are two pale yellow buttons, and then the little white fly. Um, they're a little elasticized pants, and then, you know, back in, and, and they're, they're plastic lined, because, you know, babies back then wore um, cloth diapers. And so it actually has three snaps down either side for easier changing, but I'm just going to kind of slip it on him and see if this fits him. It's listed as nine months, but I, it's a, it looks a little smaller than nine months to me, but we'll see. Well, the bottoms fit pretty good. They're a little high on him, so I don't know if this will be an outfit for him. We'll see, but I am going to dress him warmer because it is quite chilly, and um, it's just been gray and rainy, so... But I hope everybody had a fabulous Easter. We ended up just relaxing. Um, in the afternoon, I made, I like to make us a movie tray when we watch movies on the weekend where I usually put, you know, different cheeses and, you know, fruits and crackers and stuff, which I did. But this weekend included our Easter Harry and David pear, and I only cut one up. And, uh, which is why I said pear, not pears. And then um, we tried the um, chocolate and robed apricots, which is what they. What I went upstairs and read it the other day. Remember, I couldn't remember. Chocolate and robed apricots. And also they were dark chocolate. I didn't realize they were caramel eggs. I thought they were just like malted eggs. Um, but they had caramel inside, so that was a little surprise. Um... And we had those with our fruits and crackers and cheeses. Well, that actually fits 
quite nicely. Let's see. What do y'all think? So sweet. Oh, and the shirt I didn't describe. The shirt is the same yellow, and it's got a little collar, and it's a button-down. But at the bottom, at the waist, there are two buttons. And it, ha it like overlaps almost like a little belt with a point. And then there's a working pocket that has like a coat of arms embroidered on it in um, pale blue and white. And then the outline and the center part of the coat of arms is a, is a brown. And then there's, it's short sleeved and the sleeve edges are white like the waistband. What do you think, little man? Oh, I think he looks sweet in that. All right, so now we're going to put them in something toasty warm, though, because it is a little chilly out. Do I have my phone in here? If I do, I want to snap one photo, but I don't think it's here. My ankle just popped. Anyway, so um, let's change him quickly into something warmer. I hope this outfit I brought fits him. I think it's a... What size are you? I don't know if it's going to fit him. It's a baby gap up to three months. It's just a one-piece um, knit, camel-colored, um, cable-knit outfit. I'll show you all in a minute. I will button that up off-camera. I won't keep you all waiting. I actually started to put him together last night, and I also wanted to set up for Little Monkey's box packing, but my husband came home while I was... Um, what was I doing? I was getting ready to fill the limbs. I had everything lined up, and he came home, and I thought, ooh, I better set up for that box packing so I can go cook dinner. There's the outfit. It is a all-in-one cable knit, all camel colored with white buttons down the front. Let's see if this fits. I don't know if it will. Um, anyway, so my husband and I ended up cooking. He grilled steaks, and I made mashed potatoes and mushrooms and butter to go on the steak and some broccoli slaw. and So it was a delicious dinner. But I, um, come here little man man. Um, oops, sorry for the wiggle. Um, so I didn't get to finish him. And then this morning I was upstairs getting ready to come down and do Monkey's Little Box Packing and a dear friend called me and we had a lovely catch up. That was wonderful. And then I came down and got Monkey ready to go home, and I took her to the post office. Oh, I think it fits really well. So she's on her way home, so stay tuned for seeing her. She will remain on YouTube. And Casper is still in... Oh, I didn't put a necklace on you yet, yeah, little man. Casper's still in customs. Uh, my friend called today. And they said because of the Easter holiday, they had not assessed whether or not there would be charges and if there would, what they would be. So she's waiting. She's actually off work this whole week. So I'm really hoping he gets to her while she's on holiday because um, that'll be nice. So um, let me just get that little bit of hair down, huh, little man, man? Um, oh, he's so sweet. All right, let me bring y'all this way. And then he does have a passy. There's his passy. He has uh, glass eyes in brown and curly brown hair. He's so sweet. Brooded upper lashes, painted lower ones. Um, so there he is. And um, I do not conduct business in the comments. If you're interested in finding out about him, please send me a message. Um, and I'm going to throw him on Instagram and Facebook either, probably tonight. Um, I'll take a couple shots of him. And I have already taken photos of him, like just in his body and of all his, you know, limbs and everything for... So you can stay cozy, snuggly, buggly in this. Um, what was I saying, ladies? I was talking about something. Oh, Casper. So hopefully Casper will get out of customs soon. I did learn something new at the post office today because when I shipped Casper, I think I shared this with y'all, I um, found out that I could not insure him for more than $200. 
and that particular day there was only one woman working and the line was very long and so I didn't ask too many questions but I have had people reach out to me uh, recently through my website asking if I ship to the UK and I talked to the postal lady today and so we looked it up and there is you can't insure for more than two hundred dollars even if you do like Global Express and all that stuff she said some countries allow you to and some don't so that was a little baffling to me um, I was really surprised because I think in past in the past you could insure for more but I could be wrong Look, Mia Vijanier is loving her bunny book. She says, thank you, Auntie Mia. So anyway, I, um, I learned that today. And um, that's a little disconcerting, to say the least. But anyway, so hopefully Casper will be home in the next um, few days to his mommy. And um, so, yeah, stay tuned for... Um, little monkey girl getting home. I'll take Lucy Ray's passy out so she can see everybody. Huh, sweetie? You gotta brush your hair. There's my Atticus kit over there. So anyway, yeah, so that's what's been going on here, and um, we're hoping for spring. All this rain will hopefully bring us some, uh, what do they say, April showers bring May flowers, so hopefully that's the truth. I'm keeping an eye out for, um, you know, the the first things you see, which is, um, oh, it just left my head. Those bushes that have yellow leaves. Oh, darn. I just lost the name. Um, and then, you know, Lily of the Valley and Daffodils. And uh, so don't see any yet, but hopefully soon. I'm keeping my eye out. Um, but yeah, oh, and girl. I sat in this chair the other day and took her off. We have to sit you up proper there because you know your Auntie Myra likes to see you looking oh so beauty miss. She says, hi Myra. Hi. Um, and then we have to have Jean Vievre say hi to Mama Chiquita. Hi Mama Chiquita. Um, so yeah. So anyway, so it is Tuesday and uh, we are forging ahead with the weather. With the weather. With the week. Oh, my word. I guess because I was just talking about weather. Um, clematis. No, not clematis. Clematis is what I used to have climbing up and down my garage. Oh, I miss clematis. Oh, I love clematis so much. Um, forsythia. That's what you look for, the yellow forsythia bushes. That's what we see first here in the Midwest. So I'm keeping my eye out. But anyway, everybody, be blessed, and uh, I hope everybody's having a great week, and I will be back later in the week, and stay tuned for Monkey's Box Packing, and um, I think that's, oh, and Casper's, those are my two videos that are recorded on standby. Um, so anyway, everybody, thank you for stopping by, and welcome if you're new, and thank you for coming back if you've been with me. All the babies send their love to all of you. Sweet Juliet says hello to Mama Judy. She's going to send her a kiss, actually. She says, hi, Mama Judy. I love you. Mm -hmm. And then we have this sweet baby wants to send her mommy some love. Hi, Mommy. And then we'll have Lucy Ray send her mommy a bit more love. Hi, Mommy. And this little man says, are you my mommy? <laughs> I love, oh, such a sweet face. All right, uh, all right, everybody, have a fabulous, fabulous evening and rest of your week. And remember to find your joy each and every day. Loads of love, for, love from us here at Kimberly's Cocoon. Bye-bye.